I'm Zach Crawford, the deputy at St Monica's Primary School, and you're here at St Monica's today, um, launching our Walk to School program. So we have been doing Walk to School for many years. We've got nine schools involved this year, so that's two more than last year, and every year we have more schools involved. It's such a good way to encourage more kids to ride and scoot and walk to school independently. We know there's heaps of benefits to kids doing that. Some kids actually don't meet physical activity guidelines, so it's a great way to do that, and schools always report that kids are way more focused and engaged when they walk to school. Through the month of October, we are going to continue to encourage our students to use active travel, be that um, walking, riding, or using a scooter to come to school each and every day. We'll be continuing to promote that as the month goes on. And then on the 31st of this month, we're gonna have our, uh, our official walk to school day. Um, we'll provide the students with some fruit, some water. And in the lead up to that, we'll continue to provide the students with some information around the benefits of active travel. So if your kids live uh, too far away, you can maybe park your car, say, four blocks um, before school and let them ride or walk to school. We also have little um, footprints so that can guide the kids to where they've got to go.